Y'all know the body glaze been out here glazing, honey, living her best life. But everybody be wanting to know what it smell like, so here it go. First, though, we got the donut. This one went viral. Y'all already know. I already done told y'all. She saw I'm serious, honey. She's a problem. It's giving I'm rich, bitch, but I'm still humble. Next up, we got the birthday cake. It's giving frosting. Eat me. I'm cute. It's giving put me on top. That's where I belong. He want that cake, 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 cake. Y'all feel me? Well, it looks like everybody's not feeling the birthday cake and the donut. Um, we've got a TikToker who she's reviewed a few different products on her page. And she says that, you know, the body glaze smells like beeswax. And she also commented and said that it smells like it was made in a sweatshop. Now, Stormy had a whole lot of orders going out the last month or so, thousands of orders, and people are questioning whether or not the quality went down because of the quantity that she was trying to push out. But take a listen to um, what this individual had to say. She said she's given an honest review, and basically she still likes Stormy. She wasn't going to troll her page. She asked for a refund, and she got it. But she can't give an approval on this one just because of the way that it smelled. As much as I wanted to love this, it's a no for me. Initially, I could smell the scent through the package, when I applied it to my skin, all I smell is beeswax, so this will be returned. As much as I wanted to love this, it's a no for me. Initially, I could smell the scent through the package. When I applied it to my skin, all I smell is beeswax, so this will be returned. Now, under her post, she said, I'm so disappointed. I was stalking the restock, and I think the mass production is affecting the quality which that really could be the issue um someone said i said this from day one the beeswax is too overpowering but it's what makes you shine so much and i got five of them but she said it's overpriced beeswax and she responded i have 164 ounces of coconut oil if i just want to shine now someone thanked her for her honesty and she said I really hated to do this because literally each week I got on her post and prayed for her business to double, triple, and then quadruple and then this and someone responded I wondered if the demand is affecting the quality and she responded of course smells like it was made in a sweatshop. Ooh, yikes that's not good. Now, someone else commented, I bought the strawberry shortcake glaze with the shimmer. I tried using it twice and both times I had an allergic reaction. And the individual just said the oils in it are amazing, but she said the scent is trash. Someone said, I thought it was just me, but I will be returning mine as well. She said, yes, it's unfortunate, but maybe that will grab the company's attention. Um, someone said, I'm upset that everyone is returning theirs and they sent me an email that all sales are final. I wish I could screenshot it. And now, sadly, there were a lot of comments with the same sentiments. And hopefully, you know, maybe it was just a bad batch. Uh, but somebody said, I tried the donut scent and it was a no for me too. It had an old stale scent, but when I applied it, I got a faint artificial smell. You know, that's really unfortunate, um, but you know, someone else says, got donut, I'm not feeling it, I wanted cream puff. They said, somebody in the comments said cream puff wasn't worth it either. Now, you just got to believe that all of these people are not just making this up. Um, someone said, I wish I saved a video of this girl saying the same thing. She even commented multiple times it smelled like Play-Doh. They deleted the comments. Someone responded, I don't believe in spamming her comments. I gave my review and requested my refund. She can have the world-renowned product back. Now, there are some mixed reviews. Some people said, you know, when it first came out that they really loved it. Nobody complained about it, you know, smelling like this. Um, but like they said, if you're doing this mass production and you're trying to get these orders out because you're getting in 40, 50, 20,000 orders in a week, um, 
you know, if you don't have anybody doing like a quality check on the products, this is the type of stuff that happens. So beeswax, uh, I don't know. I think I passed, but sound off in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts about this, you guys. And as always, I'll talk to you in the next video. Please give this one a thumbs up and be sure to hit that notification bell so you never miss an update from what's happening.